Thanks for viewing today. You'll notice behind me that there is a large stone wall. This wall is very extensive uh, around this property and was built by a single uh, man, bringing the rocks and putting them on top of each other and building this wall. You know, in Psalms 91, it starts out by saying, He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. I want you to think about today a fortress, a mighty fortress being around you and protecting you uh, from invaders, protecting you from the enemy. And that is who the, the Lord is. He is our refuge. He is our high tower. He is a wall around us, giving us protection and watching over us. Praise the name of Jesus. I am so glad that the Lord is my fortress. I can depend on Him. I can trust Him. He will be here just like this wall is here. These stones are not going to be moved. They are sturdy. They are steadfast. They are in their place. And the Lord is around us. His mighty glory is around us. And it is protecting us from sickness, disease, um, abuse, depression, mental illness, anything, financial difficulties, anything that the enemy tries to throw at us is going to go onto this wall and bounce right back in the enemy's face. Hallelujah! I thank the Lord that He is our fortress. Let's read on. Surely He will save me from the fowler snare and from the deadly pestilence. You do not have to put up with harassment. You do not have to put up with abuse. You do not have to put up with sickness and disease because all of those things are enemies to our Lord, to our God. Praise the name of Jesus. I'm glad I am in the family of God and that I have a protection and a fortress around me just like this stone wall. It took hours and days and months for this man to build this wall. You know, I think about this wall and I think of the wall of Jericho. I think that, you know, that, that wall around Jericho was built uh, for the protection of those people. You know, and around cities, uh, especially in Jesus' time, they built fortresses. In England, they built fortresses and and, and mighty towers so they could see the enemy from afar off. He will cover me with his feathers, and under his wings you will find refuge. His faithfulness will be your shield and your rampart. You will not fear the terror by night, nor the arrow that flies by day, for the pestilence and that stalks in the darkness, because he is your protection. Can you say amen? If you are a child of God, then He is your protection today. If you're not a child of God, you can certainly be so. This very moment, you can call upon the name of Jesus and you shall be saved. So I invite you to come into the kingdom of God today. I compel you to come into the kingdom of God today. And let God be your high tower and your fortress and your wall of protection. And he will certainly do that. Thank you for viewing.